three, two, one. Okay, logic and tremor. Let's see if we can do something with it. Now, I think there's some limitations with tremor and logic. So let's see how you can get around them. <coughs> Excuse me, let's have a listen. That's the limitation number one, crackly audio. Let's reload it. <clears throat> reload it as mono and then as stereo. I think that's a bug in it. Let's try again. <laughs> Now doing it via multi-timbral, that is a bit of a problem because Logic doesn't seem to want to bounce a multi-timbral instrument when it hasn't got the MIDI there to bounce it. So it can't just bounce a, an instrument when the audio is playing. Now I've tried routing it and it's just it was having none of it. So what you have to do, the old fashioned way, is to solo and then bounce and re-import via the bin. So solo each channel, command B, give it a name, this is the kick. Add to audio bin just here. Actually, I've just forgotten. Tell it what area to bounce, otherwise it'll bounce all the tune. Bounce. Then repeat, solo next one, snare. Now to be fair, it's all a bit of a faff. Hi-hat. FX1. nearly there FX2 FX3 <coughs> Perk 1 last but not least Perk 2 Okay, get rid of this bad boy. Don't need it no more. Oh, it's also worth pointing out, don't export it with the swing. It seems to uh, not export very well. Then select those. And then import. Create new tracks. There we go.